Hey there! How much are you willing to pay for a three-digit domain name? Maybe sixteen dollars, maybe even a hundred and sixty, or a hundred and sixty thousand? No? Well, an unidentified collector recently paid over one hundred and sixty thousand dollars for the five 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 dot eth. Domain name. Now, ENS domain names have been fueling the latest NFT craze, and people are buying, selling, and even forming exclusive clubs around them. Also, by the way, if you still don't get the concept of ENS domain names, we suggest that you watch our video covering the basics first. Anyway, let's take a look at the most popular ENS NFTs. So. Make sure that you watch the whole video to find out the emoji domain name that sold for over twenty-two thousand dollars. We will sample some of the most popular ENS NFTs categorized by ENS Vision, a handy tool that tracks ENS domain names. Now, note that these categories are ranked according to twenty-four hour volume at the time of making this video. All right, let's get started. All right, to kick us off, let's check out the English verbs category. So this category consists of randomly minted verbs with varying lengths. But like most ENS domain names, shorter words have the potential of fetching higher prices. As you can see, art.eth last sold for around 30 Ethereum, same as gas.eth. The most expensive verb domain name to date, though, is trade.eth, which was sold for around 50 Ethereum. All right, next, let's check out the three-letter first name category. As expected, popular names are fetching crazy amounts. For instance, Jim.eth was last sold for 25 Ethereum. For Minion fans, Gru.eth is going for about 3.5 Ethereum right now. However, Sam.eth takes the cake in this category, last purchased for 100 Ethereum. Okay, next up we have the 100K Club, which consists of domain names of the first 100,000 digits. So from 00000 to 99999. After investors and collectors went crazy over four-digit domain names, the 100K Club was formed. Now, some US residents were quick to match their five-digit domain names to their postal code, which also has five digits. The most expensive domain in this category is 88888.eth, which was last sold for around 6.88 Ethereum. This domain name also belongs to the five-digit palindrome collection, which basically contains five-digit numbers that read the same forward or backward. Then another category that has been fetching crazy amounts is the pre-punk club. Most names in this category were minted before 2017. They are domain names that were minted before the CryptoPunks collection. There are about 55,000 minted domain names in this category, with the most expensive one being Paradigm.eth, and it's fetching around a whopping 420 Ethereum in its last sale. Then it's also not just English words or numbers that have been popping off. The Arabic 999 Club, which contains Arabic numerals from 000 to 999, has also been getting a lot of attention. The Arabic numeral 000 is the most expensive domain name in this category and went for around 100 Ethereum in its last purchase. Then, who said that your domain name has to be words or numbers? Next up, we have the single emoji category. With over 1,000 emojis in this category, several of them have been sold for over $1,000. The most expensive single emoji, the polar bear, was last sold for 3.45 Ethereum. And then there's also the triple emoji category, which instead of one emoji per domain name is three. The highest sale made in this category is the dollar sign domain name, which fetched over 15 Ethereum or $22,000. Okay, then last but definitely not least is the collection that triggered the ENS NFT hype. So 
Venus was launched in May 2017, but it wasn't until 2022 that it really caught on. One of the catalysts was the 10K Club. So on April 26, 2022, users began frantically buying numbered ENS domains from 0000 to 9999 without any centralized coordination. So a Twitter account and a private Discord server exclusive to holders was then created. At the time of writing, the 10K Club domain names lead in both the 24-hour traded volume and the total traded volume. 8888.eth features as the most expensive domain name in the collection, last sold for 38 Ethereum. So then you might be wondering why are ENS suddenly so popular? Well, apart from FOMO, it's clear that users are noticing the value of holding an ENS domain, using it not only as a form of digital identity, but also as a status symbol. And this has led to the decentralized domain service earning over 52 million revenue this year, according to Dune Analytics. So like Web2, domains related to big brand names are very expensive. So naturally, domain squatting is a thing in ENS. So this is where someone buys a domain to block other people from buying it with the goal of reselling it for profit. So for example, recently the domain Amazon.eth was offered 1 million USDC by an unidentified wallet address on OpenSea. The bid was however ignored by the owner despite the last sale of the domain name being a couple of months prior for 33 Ether or $48,642 at the time of making this video. Now, I don't know, maybe the owner was hoping to get more than $1 million, who knows? Now, the same goes for domains belonging to subgroups like the 10K Club. Due to their scarcity and exclusiveness, they tend to fetch higher prices. Now, all in all, it seems that ENS names are not only popular for now, but they're here to stay. So, do you own an ENS domain name? Well, let us know in the comments. And of course, also remember to like, subscribe, and follow us on all our socials for future alpha. See ya.